The National COVID-19 Task Force and the Public Health Ministry had moved to enforce the lockdown less than one week ago at Maruka Region 1 and at Arangoy's Landing in Region 7, meaning that all activities were to be suspended. However, residents took to the streets to vent their frustrations with the fact that the authorities have instituted a lockdown without providing economic relief packages for the households and businesses businesses there. Throughout the picketing, masks were worn with adherence to social distancing. In a social media post, Regional Vice Chair Sarah Brown said she listened to the plights of residents as they shared their concerns. According to her, farmers are denied access to their lands and other persons are restricted from accessing the hospital. Cargo boats are denied entry while carrying supplies for local businesses. While vendors were told to operate for three hours, it was indicated that this cannot suffice to provide for their families. The Guyana police force in a statement on the matter said no permission was granted for the protest and that the crowd eventually dispersed. There are over 70 positive COVID-19 cases in Region 1. Rupa Sinarine, The Evening News.